Senator Amy Klobuchar's husband is helping to fight COVID-19 after his own recovery from the virus. David Schumann spoke to the couple today about the decision to donate blood plasma. It has been a transformative experience just because of what's happening around the country. Senator Amy Klobuchar says her husband, John Bessler, was the seventh person to recover from coronavirus to give blood at the Mayo Clinic. He donated his plasma for the antibodies, which could help others recover like he did. Klobuchar says it's important for more people to do the same. They kind of are giving their immunities, but it's really an opportunity to help other people. John overcame a hospital stay where he experienced fever, pneumonia, and dangerously low oxygen levels. I don't think I'd go out and run try to run a marathon right now, which I have in the past, but I, I do feel better. I'm going out for long walks and I do feel like I'm, I'm getting back to normal. It was a scare for our family, just like so many people are going through right now. John waited to give until he was no longer contagious, which doctors say is critical. Dr. Frank Rame at Abbott Northwestern Hospital says it's hard to know, though, exactly how helpful plasma donations will be. It's the best we got and it's reasonable to hope it'll work. That's why he says the more people who donate, the more they'll learn. It's likely enough to help compared to how likely it is to hurt that I, I tell patients that it, it's, it's worth it. And to be clear, giving antibodies is separate from the creation of a vaccine. With vaccines, patients develop their own antibodies. David Schumann, WCCO 4 News. If you've had a positive COVID-19 test and are interested in donating plasma, we have a link on our website, wccocom links.